the career mode and this time we are in Italy sadly uh, without Milan and Inter but Napoli and Roma back but that won't change the thing we will have a lot of fun in the Italian leagues and we are going to be with Sampdoria a very old club who has won the league title once have been in the European Cup final once and they have won the Cup Winners Cup once. A long time ago, they haven't won a title in over 30 years and it's time to do something about it, right? So let's dig in in our career mode in Italy and in charge we are going to have Arda Tura. So, let's talk about the tactics. Something is new in FC25 and we are going to play, at least start, with 3, 4, 2, 1 and with counter build-up style. And um, I will see, we will adapt during the season to see what works and what not works. Uh, interesting is that we want to play with ball playing defenders uh, the back and we will have a really good center back in the middle hold the force as you could say and that will be the backbone of our defense moving to the midfield we're gonna try to have a deep line playmaker on the right side because we have players who fit that well so I think we're gonna try with that and we're also gonna have a box to box Midfield in the midfielder in the middle uh, to compensate to have somebody going together with the attack on the wings uh, we're gonna have winger uh, mainly will put in some um, crosses uh, and sometimes maybe attack in the middle uh, just to give base for our shadow strikers this one I am not sure but we're gonna start with at least have two shadow strikers supporting or advance forward at the top. Like I said, this is a little bit of try and error. And we will see what will work with the play style we have. But I really like the new thing they have added this year. We're gonna give it a real good try. So, how about transfer plan? Well, the plan is to keep the squad uh, as it is and probably not add so much, but we have a few older players that are on the last year of the contract and probably if we get some bits on them, we're going to sell them. Uh, at least everyone, but not our goalkeeper, Silvestri.
time we will use the preseason games to learn about our team and our tactics. So let's see how it went. Match day is upon us. Fans are pouring into the stadium. Anticipation has reached an all-time high. All the action here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to Dortmund's Signal Iduna Park. My name's Guy Mowbray, delighted to be joined by Sue Smith for commentary. And we have pre-season group stage action coming right up for you. How do you see this one going then, Sue? Yeah, well, they'll have done lots of training coming into today, but there's nothing like being back on the pitch. I'm sure that both sides will be a little bit rusty, but hopefully we get a good game. Moving forward well. Super challenge. He stopped a certain goal. This for one nil. They have paid the penalty. It's been dispatched. Well, here it is again. He sent the keeper the wrong way, kept his cool and slotted it home. Nice finish. Now, this might be promising. And there's the whistle. It's a penalty. And that is also going to be a yellow card. It's a correct decision. Good officiating that. It had to be a yellow. an even firmer grip on the game scores the penalty efficiently put away well here's the replay this is a strong penalty he chose to go straight down the middle the goalkeeper guesses early and he just watches the ball fly into the back of the net Rosio. And it's all over. Happy faces right around the ground. What are your thoughts, Sue? Yeah, it was a positive performance. Some of the play today was great to watch. They moved the ball quick and created some really good openings. It's a good result. Constant threat. Took his goals well, too.
to have you with us. We've travelled today to the Bismarckstrasse in Leverkusen. We're at the Bay Arena. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And we have more live action from the pre-season second group stage. It is Augsburg facing Sampdoria. The ball with Meyer. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like trouble in the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. an attack of promise but they couldn't take advantage of the situation and with that the referee brings this match to an end both sides have their moments over the course of the 90 minutes but it finishes in a stalemate Stuart what did you make of it all well yes Derek probably not the best game I don't think either team played to their full potential the final ball was often lacking and the chances they did create they were unable to take advantage of a bit disappointing really as I was expecting more What a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. Hello, everyone. Talking to you today from a part of Germany where people really enjoy life. We're in the Rheinland at the Bay Arena in Leverkusen. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And we have pre-season action to bring you with the final group stage game just moments away. He's in here. And not cleared away properly. Oh, could be an opportunity here. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. And just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think the keeper had it covered. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? Strong hand on the ball. Knudsen. Oh, in for the chance. And a goal! Just when we wonder that this might finish nil now. There it is. They're in front. Koda. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Chances on. Well, at this stage of the game, you have to be more ruthless. Well, that just might be their last chance. What a miss that is. Can he take advantage? And foiled only by the crossbar. But no, he's fluffed his lines. Good heavens. Well, that's the chance they've been looking for. The question is, will they get another one? Time is running out now. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. And a really good diving stop. Well, this late corner could represent the last chance to equalise. See about the delivery and knocked out of there. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. Well, Derek, it was a hard fought contest which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. And he fully deserved to score that winning goal. Interesting pre season, right? Have you learned anything? Yes, our defense feels strong. 
but we still have hard time scoring goals so it will be interesting to see if we can find how to play with this tactic but I'm feeling confident uh, going into the first league game.